here and welcome to your bridal boot camp. Today we are doing the number one most requested muscle group for brides everywhere, the back. Why? Well, a lot of dresses are backless, like mine, but also guys, your back gives you that beautiful posture. It opens up your chest. It brings your shoulders down if you've got a strong back and a strong core. And then you basically just float down the aisle like a swan? Is that a good, like Casper the ghost? I don't know. Something white and flowy, like a cloud. Like a cloud, that's a lot better. Um, so today we're gonna work on really opening up your chest, Bringing your shoulders down, like stop being so hunched up, like relax guys, relax, lengthening your neck and also giving you the strength in your back to stand tall and to stand confidently because that's how you want to walk down the aisle. You want to be the best version of yourself. You want to feel beautiful and look beautiful. So you've got 10 moves today, one minute each, there's no break and your moves are walnut crushers, goal post puncher, reverse plank lifts, Bird dog pulses on both sides, parachuters, half cobra grasshopper, snow angel belly, and finally you'll end with flying bird dog, both sides. All right guys, ready to get started? Let's do this. All right, your first move is the walnut crusher. So what I want you guys to do is to bring your elbow to shoulder height. Do not drop lower than that, please, because I really want this to be effective, so leave it up. Hands like so. You're gonna create a rainbow with your elbow, just like this, pressing back, really squeezing your shoulder blades together like that, as if you are crushing a walnut. Yes, that is why it's called Walnut Crushers. Okay, guys, we got 10 moves, 10 minutes, no breaks. Let's go ahead and start that timer. Let's go. Boom, I'm pressing back, pressing back. So I'm warning you, it's gonna get tough real quick, okay? now. When things get tough, we tend to squeeze our necks and bring our shoulders towards our ears, but I need you to just relax. I need you to just let your back do the work, okay? Crush those nuts. Bring it back, bring it back. Come on, boom, boom. Now, if you wanna sit cross-legged, if you wanna sit merm style, if you wanna stand, I don't care. As long as your back is tall, as long as you're feeling confident, your chest is open, that's all I care about, okay? Because we gotta get these moves in. And they gotta look good and they gotta feel good. When I say feel good, I mean you just gotta feel it. It might feel torturous. Our definition of good may be different. <laughs> okay, ready for goal post punchers? Okay, check it out. You're here, then you're here, then you punch back in and up. Let's go. Down, out, in and up. Out and up. Oh, do you feel your shoulders? I bet you do. Now, that also means you might be tensing up that neck. So relax the neck. If you need to close your eyes, whatever you need to do, relax the neck. Don't let the shoulders hunch up towards your ears. Woo, I feel that. Let's go. And out, and out. You got it. Boom, nice. And punch it out. A punch it out. Let's go. Boom, and lift. You've got 15 seconds left. Come on. Fight through it. It's hurting me too, okay? This is not easy. Almost there. And then we're into our reverse plank lifts. Ooh, okay, you guys. So, if you are a beginner, you can place your legs hip width apart, hands towards the butt, and lift up right here into a tabletop-like position, okay? And if you are feeling super advanced today or you want an extra challenge, legs together or slightly hip-width apart and bring it up and coming back down, okay? Exhale, lifting up and coming back down. I want you to squeeze your quads. Squeeze your arms. Squeeze your abs. Really engage your entire body. Very good, and I really feel my shoulders opening up right here. It's actually an extremely good stretch. Keep going, guys. A lift and lower. And down, come on. Less than 10 seconds left of this move. We're reaching up high, long legs, strong legs. And up 
and lower. Okay guys, we got bird dog pulses. So onto all fours, what I want you to do is to lift up the arm, lift up opposite leg and simply pulse, pulse. It's a tiny little movement. Your eyes are down on the mat, okay? You're gonna feel a lot of upper back, lower back, you're gonna feel the booty, the whole thing. And look, if you get tired, don't drop the hand. Don't drop the leg. What I want you to do is to keep it right here, okay? You don't have to pulse, but please don't put it down. I want you to work hard, okay? I want you to get that body and get that life that you deserve. But look guys, it ain't gonna be given to you. You gotta work for it. Up, up, like Britney said. Up, up. Come on, 10 seconds left. Up. Lift, lift, so close. You're right there. In three, two, one, bring it down. Other side, immediately lift. Get a fresh booty, a fresh other side of the back. Come on, reaching, doing so good. Up, and once we finish these, we get to lay in our bellies, but that doesn't mean you get a break. Nope, be more back work. But you guys, these bridal boot camp videos are only 10 minutes long, and you don't need anything fancy to get in shape, to feel good for that big day. Now, whether that's your wedding, another event, or maybe you just wanna feel good every day, that's what working out is for. Of course, it's gonna make you look good. More importantly, it's a part of your lifestyle. It's gonna make you feel good, or else you're not gonna stick to it. Trust me, I thought that, you know, when I was younger, I could just follow these diets or follow these quickie plans for, you know, four weeks or, 10 day slim downs or whatever. It doesn't work like that. It's gotta be a lifestyle. Okay, we're heading all the way down. I just wanna lay here for our parachuters. So check it out, y'all. Goal post position with the elbows, 90 degrees. You are simply going to lift up and lower. Exhale up and down. You've got it. Lift and lower. Take your time. I really want you to squeeze your quads. Squeeze your butt. Exhale, lift, inhale, down. Exhale, up, inhale, down. And take your time, okay? And lower. Squeezing and lowering. Exhale, up, inhale, down. You feel that? 10 seconds more, come on. Hold for a second when you're up there. Hold. Good, last one. Up and down. Okay, bring your hands underneath your shoulders. Bring the knees out as wide at, out as wide as the mat. You're gonna lift up, okay? So it's okay if your hips go up here. Elbows back. And then once you're almost down, lift up right there, okay? So you got it up. A lot of triceps. You've got some booty and lower back. This is your half cobra grasshopper. You're lifting and up, okay? Again, it is okay to bring those hips up. Boom. Ooh, I feel like a seesaw. Come on. Up. Ooh. Reach and down. Come on. Up. You're doing so good. Perfect. How are you guys feeling out there? Feeling good? All right. If you're getting tired, it is okay, because that means you are working hard. And lift it up, and down. Okay, very good. Now guys, we're into our snow angel bellies, which means you get to stay right here. Let's check it out. Legs, um, the corners of the mat, hands right here. Lifting it up, okay? Get those quads off the mat. You're going to place the hands behind the low back, and reaching forward. And we're staying here the entire time. You are not putting those legs down, but if you need to, that's okay. But really try, 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 try to keep those quads up. This is a difficult move, all right? Because I want you to get stronger, okay? Everything can't be easy. If it were easy, everyone would do it, right? Lift. Breathe. You've got this. Oh, I'm feeling it. Come on. A 
couple more. Oh, actually, last one. And down. Okay, guys, last two moves. You've got your flying bird dog. So, on all fours again, okay? This time, as your leg comes out, the arm doesn't come in front, it comes to the side. And you fly. You fly. So it's almost like the bird dog pulses, but now your arms to the side, and you feel your upper back like crazy. Up, breathe. You guys are doing so good. This is the last minute and 30 seconds you can get through this. And I'm really proud of you. These are challenging for me too. You may not see it because the flowers are distracting. My outfit matching the flowers is distracting, but I am in pain. I am very much in pain. Lift, lengthen, almost there. Come on, reaching. Three, two, one. Okay, quick switch. Last move, guys. We're reaching out. Let's go, up. Float those arms. You are a swan. You are an angel. Whatever other flying objects you want to be. Maybe you're a pterodactyl. Pterodactyl, how do you say that? Pterodactyl, I think. Um, maybe you're a bat. I don't know. Have you seen a bat in real life? They're kind of cute and they're kind of creepy at the same time. They have a face of a dog and then the body of a vampire. Scary, but cute, I guess. Keep going, less than 25 seconds left. Reaching high. Do not let that leg sag. Do not let that arm sag. Push yourself, guys. Last 15. Come on, do this with me. And this together. Up, I am shaking. Come on. You got five. Four, three, two, one. Oh, oh my gosh, my back. Ooh, that feels good. Let's go ahead and stretch it out, you guys. On all fours, I want you to curl that back here. Oh. And then low back, cup of soup, booty in the air, chest up. Again, curl. And then stretch. And then come down into a child's pose. Stretch that back long. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. One more time. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Slowly reach up with control, rolling the shoulders back. And give yourselves a big round of applause. That was extremely difficult. You know what? That's how I know it's gonna be super effective. And with just 10 minutes of this workout, you just became a taller, stronger, and more confident bride or person or whoever. So thank you so much for joining me on this bridal bootcamp workout. I can't wait to see you for the next video and make sure to check out all my other bridal bootcamp videos um, so that you can get ready for your big day. All right, I love you so much and I'll see you next time. Bye.